guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to talk to you about my top 6 favorite MAC lipsticks for Indian skin tones. I have divided it into 3 parts. I've put 2 in the category of pinks and corals. I've put 2 in the category of uh, neutrals and browns. And 2 in the category of oranges and reds. And I'm pretty sure you already know what I'm going to talk about. But I can already see my battery light flashing, my battery indicator flashing. So I'm not really going to spend more time uh, in the introduction and I'm going to get straight into it. The first lipstick that I'm wearing right now is a beautiful coral lipstick that I think is going to suit most Indian skin tones and this is Crosswires where Crosswires is left as a stub with me right now. I just have barely anything left and this is my second tube of Crosswires. I love this lipstick. Um, I think it looks great on every single skin tone that I've seen it on. On some people it pulls more pink, on some people it pulls more coral and more orange. Uh, some people it pulls a little peach but it looks beautiful nonetheless. It's a cream sheen formula. Cream sheens are not my most favorite formulas. Uh, they are slightly glossy and they don't really last as long but as a lipstick this is one of my top favorites. My second favorite MAC lipstick is a pink lipstick called Speak Louder. Speak Louder looks beautiful on every single skin tone. It's a bright pink that doesn't really um, wash Indian skin tones out. It's not neon so it can be carried off by a lot of people with varied skin tones. This is also a cream sheen formula but then this does last on me a lot longer than Crosswires and it slightly stains my lips, not really, uh, it doesn't really stain my lips too much but it does leave a little bit of a tint behind so I really love this lipstick, it's one of my favourites. This is actually my wedding lipstick, I, I wore it on my wedding day and I love this lipstick a lot. The lipstick that I'm going to talk to you about is Meher and Meher is a beautiful matte lipstick. Mattes are my favourite formula from MAC. MAC makes the best matte lipsticks in my opinion and Meher is a very beautiful pink brown lipstick it does have a pastel pink quality to it and this is uh, a little darker than my really favorite lipstick Cosmo which I'm not really showing here because Cosmo doesn't really suit a lot of skin tones I've seen Cosmo is uh, my personal favorite but I've not really seen it working across all skin tones but Meher does work on a lot of people whether you're really fair or if you are quite dusky as well so I love Meher and this is how it looks on me. The fourth lipstick I'm going to talk to you about is Bricola and Bricola is a brick brown lipstick. It is brown but it does have a brick color to it. It is beautiful. I think it is going to suit a lot of skin tones. This looks stunning on a lot of skin tones. This is an amplified cream finish. Amplified cream finishes are packed with pigment so it won't really show on your lips uh, but it's really comfortable to wear as well this is my tube which is really old my mom owns it as well and she loves it a lot I love Bricola I'm really getting this again it's a beautiful fall lipstick on some on some it might even pull a little bit nude but then it's going to look stunning on every single skin tone next lipstick I'm talking about is so short it's a beautiful orange red lipstick on some it might pull a little orange on some it might just pull a little extra red but So Short is a beautiful, beautiful matte lipstick and I think it's going to look stunning on every single skin tone. I've seen this working across a lot of skin tones. The last lipstick I'm talking about needs no introduction. I'm talking about Ruby Woo. Ruby Woo is the most beautiful red in this entire world. I feel it's my most favorite red lipstick across all brands. And Ruby Woo is not an iconic color for nothing. I think it looks stunning on every single skin tone. I really love Ruby Woo. It's a beautiful blue base red. It makes my teeth look whiter and I really, really like this. The only drawback to Ruby Woo though is that it is a retro matte finish which means that it is really drying. It's not the easiest lipstick to apply but I think the color makes up for it. It is so gorgeous. I can't not apply this lipstick every time there's a special occasion. And the best part is that it really lasts really really long on me and I don't even feel like I'm wearing any lipstick on my lips after I put this on it doesn't really budge I love Ruby Woo a lot of people love Ruby Woo if you don't really own Ruby Woo you should go try it out and buy it for yourself it's you won't regret it these six lipsticks I would totally recommend to every single person across all skin tones because I've seen them working really well on most skin tones these are foolproof fail proof colors and if you really want to pick one as one of your first matte lipsticks or the next matte lipstick don't forget to check one of these six out at least thanks so much for watching guys please give this video a thumbs up if you found it interesting and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already i'll see you in my next video bye